His name is Joseph Kaplan, and after 20 years at IBM, he decided it was time to follow his dream and write. So he began the Van Wyck Gazette. To write. And uh, it soon became apparent with the community newsletter that it was feasible. Mm -hmm and uh, there was support from friends and neighbors. The Van Wyck Gazette was founded in 2007 by Joseph Kaplan. In it, you can find anything from local restaurant reviews, pet care tips, cooking tips, CD reviews, and even tips on meditation. And in the most recent issue, you can find an article about a world-renowned Impressionist painter, Jose Acosta. His works hang at the World Bank in Washington, D.C., and um, uh, most are at a private gallery in Miami. I mean, this is a Hudson Valley resident, but here you have um, someone that basically lives a 20-minute ride away whose paintings hang all over the world. And the free 16-page Gazette is available every 16 weeks. Kaplan says it's a labor of love, and he says what sets it apart from other publications is his staff of writers. I have neighbors, friends, local entrepreneurs, even former friends that have left the state, each an expert in their own right, that it, they insist that I publish, and they contribute each and every time. What do you think the future is of, of the Van Wyck Gazette? <laughs> well... Our hope is that the magazine continues to grow, continues to expand, attract more advertisers, and increases in circulation. I have to mention that Mr. Kaplan hand delivers the Van Wyck Gazette to about 1,000 families. It's also available at the Walkley over the Hudson in Poughkeepsie, on the Poughkeepsie side, at the Farmer's Market.